Hypixel finally did it, we have a new Bad Boys update. That means I will be playing on every single map they added, and on top of that I have a little win streak right now, I kind of don't want to risk that, so I'm just gonna play on my alt account, I just uh, wanted to greet you on my main here. <laughs> Let's get into the video. All right, here we are on the first map in the first game. And um, yeah, this base looks pretty fancy from the inside. I'm, I'm not sure, what rush is this? This is like a really short rush. I'm just gonna go for pink. This should actually be a diagonal rush. So far, I've seen no one rush any other way. Like everyone I've seen, okay, you're not doing anything, but it looks like, yeah, everyone should be diagonal rushing. All right, here we go. Okay, good. We took out the first rush. Now that I think about it, it's probably pretty good that we lost our bet, since now we have to go mid to get some emeralds to clutch this. Now we can show off mid. I hear a lot of explosions. That's scary. Okay. Uh, here is a generator. I really like this mid. It's pretty flat, but it looks pretty fancy as well. I also like the diamond gen and how close everything is together. I'm, I'm a fan of this map, not gonna lie. It's probably gonna end up in my favorites. I'm not sure if it's going to turn out to be a problem later on, that uh, everything is so close together. That's probably gonna make it so if you just wait for 8 iron to do a really, really quick rush, you can actually confuse a couple of people and uh, get bets really quickly. Uh, so this is definitely gonna be a really fast map, and I'm not sure if I'm that big of a fan if it's that fast. Let's take a blue. They still have a bat. I'll just pot on them. I don't know if they are good. Oh my god! I can't even speak anymore. Lul. Oh, <laughs> I wanted to say oh my god. Alright, got their bat. And they died. Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, <laughs> next new map. Okay, this is weird. You spawn and you instantly have- Oh! You instantly have a window in front of you, and there's your bed. That's pretty cool. It's also a pretty fast map. I mean, I assume every new map here to be a fast iron map. <laughs> and I believe this should be a side rush. Of course, my goal is to win every single game we play here. But I'm not sure if we can do that. Also, I didn't land that ladder clutch and it looked really cringe. <laughs> Alright, you're not gonna buy a better sword. Oh, you are, since you can kill me. That's unfortunate. <laughs> Especially since later on, we're also gonna play a couple uh, 3Bs, 4Bs maps. I'm probably gonna do it in 3Bs, I'm not sure yet. And uh, those are probably not too easy to win, but then again, I'm not sure. Maybe it's easy to win. I feel like hit detection is a little bit different when you don't have a rank. That would be really scummy they wouldn't do that, right? <laughs> Alright, you don't want to have a bat? Okay, I can obviously take it if you don't want it anymore. Here you go. And now you want to have mine, I assume. But that's not going to work out for you, since I am going to fireball you off. <laughs> well, that was even better. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't planned, but it was really funny. Alright, uh, aqua and yellow are still a thing. I do enjoy this mid. It looks really good. The map in general, I'm not a huge fan of its looks, but uh, it seems like it's a pretty good map to play on. Just gameplay-wise, there's nothing against it. It's really, really small again. I feel like these new maps are all really small from what I've seen so far. And uh, I totally understand why they're going for that. It makes sense. But, um, I don't know. Not sure if I'm that big of a fan. Alright, this person just voided. I think what I'm gonna do here, I'm just gonna go in this. And then it's gonna be really spooky. Ooh, a joke is atta- uh, A joke. A ghost is attacking you, not a joke. I'm not a joke. Come on, you know I'm not a joke, right? <laughs> Next game. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
So this map is called Mirage, and just from standing here, the view feels amazing for some reason. These stairs you have going on here are definitely interesting, but I feel like they're gonna be really annoying. And I believe this should be a straight rush, yeah. It feels like a straight rush. It really feels like a straight rush. I feel like the islands are made for straight rushing here. You can't say anything against that. Also, I wanted to hit you off. Don't mind the sounds, by the way. I have a wild discussion with my school right now. It's really annoying, I know. <laughs> Just ignore it. I'm gonna try to cut it off, uh, cut it out as much as I can. Where are the diamond? Oh, wait. The diamonds are there. Wait a second. Is it the way I think it is? Do you have an emerald gen, a single one at mid, like in the very center? And then you have four diamond gens around that? Or isn't it the way it is? I believe here. Um, oh, never. Oh my god. What is. Wait, what? Okay. Mid is really interesting here. I really like this for some reason. It doesn't make sense gameplay wise, or at least it is going to make gameplay a little hard. But I, I like this. I like it a lot. It kind of reminds me of Acropolis. I know it looks really different. But uh, just from this feel that you can easily get a lot of diamonds and emeralds by just going mid. That feels like Acropolis, not gonna lie. See, just like that, we have eight diamonds and we can do boop, 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 boop. Holy man. And if I wanted, I could have gotten eight emeralds and like, how many? 16? I think I could have gotten eight emeralds and 16 diamonds right away at mid. So that's really overpowered and makes me not want to play this map anymore, since you're not always going to be the one getting all these resources. Someone is going to do it for you, and then you're pretty done for it. This rush seems really far. I think this could take a stack of blocks. This is definitely a bigger map than the others, so I know I said I think they're going to bring us a lot of maps that are really small. This doesn't seem to be a small map. This is like a, I'd say, mid-sized map. They're not only gonna release really small maps, but also a couple mid-sized maps by the look of it. Also, that sentence was really hard to say. <laughs> mid-sized maps by the look of it. All right. Uh, you are going to die. I got something. I think I leveled up. Indeed, I am now high pixel level 14. <laughs> Isn't that great? If you're in my Discord, you already know this, but I'm working on a dream documentary, like a documentary video about Dream, the YouTuber. That video is like over nine minutes long, I believe, and it's really taken a while. I know, it uh, had to concentrate for a second. <laughs> Scary. Uh, it, it really is going to still take a while. I only animated like two minutes out of nine to ten minutes I probably have to still animate. It's uh, gonna take a while. As soon as it's done, it's really, really great. Trust me. No, don't do that. All right, you didn't know what you're doing, luckily, since my aim was so bad there, oh my god. Oh, by the way, in case you were wondering, this diagonal rush between blue and green, for example, is easily a 48 rush, maybe even 64. So it's, it's really far. Oh, wait, huh. All right, I guess I won. <laughs> well, <laughs> GG's. All right, here we go. This map is called Dockyard and holy man, I enjoy, okay, we have stairs again. This is kind of weird, but this looks really fancy from the inside, not going to lie. These rushes are both pretty far. I believe it could be a diagonal rush. And I think from what I've seen there, Pink thinks so too. They also jumped in my general direction. I actually considered buying a rank on this account. It's really hard to play like this. First of all, I feel like your hits are almost registering worse and with a rank. Second of all, I can't queue maps that I want to queue. I literally have to queue maps randomly until I finally get the maps I want to play for this video. And that's so annoying. It took me like 10 minutes to queue this map. Oh my god. Uh, then what's the next problem? The next problem is you can't type slash L most of the time. If you want to go to the lobby, then you can't type slash L most of the time. 
you you can like join a game, then type slash L, and then join a game again. But you can't type slash L anymore un 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 until it starts. Okay, I can't speak. Until it starts. So you have to disconnect and then join again. What is that? <laughs> what is that? And then whenever you join like a Bell Wars lobby, or like most of the time, you just get stuck in the ground when you don't have a rank. We're gonna go mid to show off mid, but that's not actually what I wanted to talk about, the whole rank thing. Instead, I wanted to talk about Hypixel. Hypixel actually got hacked again today. It was really scary. I saw it on Twitter. When I tried to join Hypixel, it was already fixed, but I saw it on Twitter. It was really scary. Their website and server got, like, hacked. Uh, obviously, it has been resolved. I can play. Uh, I enjoyed this mid. I really do. It's it's really good. It doesn't feel like Acropolis. You still have to bridge a bunch. Uh, but I really do enjoy this map. Yes. Which, by the way, that's a good thing. <laughs> the map not being like Acropolis when it comes to that is actually a really good thing. So no one just randomly gets OP. I believe this is one of my favorite maps so far. For some reason, the mid seems really ugly to me. I can't describe why. I can't quite tell you what I consider ugly about this. It's just not my thing, I don't know. It looks kind of weird, but I understand what they were going for with this, and I do enjoy the concept, for sure. And also gameplay-wise, it, it seems like a really good map. It also seems pretty big, but that's not a problem. It seems like a really good map, and against it being big, we're gonna get four bridge eggs. I love this. <laughs> Let's get green. That's not smart. I'm just gonna fireball you up. Goodbye. Wait. You can fall down there. Goodbye now. Eh. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Alright, boys and girls. We are eight stars now. And, uh, yeah. Next map. Alright. Serenity, Serenity. I don't know what to call this map. The inside of the base. Mm, not my cup of tea, actually. What is this? Oh. Wait. Okay, this is pretty cool. Not gonna lie. Uh, but overall, this map looks insane. I love mid, uh, even though it seems really connected, so it's gonna be an Acropolis situation here. But this map looks so pretty, and also it reminds me of a ranked Skywars map. I don't play ranked Skywars, I've played it like once, but I've seen it in an RKY video. Okay, it seems to be a diagonal rush. All right, Red. Nice. <laughs> By the way, you probably just saw me changing perspective there really confidently, and that is because I have a new perspective key. You know, Game Boy 80 inspired me to choose my perspective key. I was like, I need some key that isn't F5, that is easily reachable, that I can use to change perspective, because it's pretty important at some point in your gameplay. Here and there, you want to change your perspective. So, I listened to Game Boy 80 and switched my perspective key from F5 to Enter on the number pad. I know Game 80 didn't say that to be the perspective key. The Game of 80 never said make enter on the numpad your perspective key. But GB80 has P as a perspective key. So every time he wants to change his perspective, he lifts his hand up from his mouse and then he changes the perspective. And I kind of got inspired by that. I chose enter on the numpad because it's easily recognizable when you reach there blindly and uh, basically i used to toggle my perspective by also letting go of my mouse and then clicking enter but of course you can't hold your mouse for that little amount of time so i thought i need a new one and i switched and uh, basically now my new perspective toggle key is on my mouse. You probably know I have a mouse with 12 side buttons so I can hotkey. I use my mouse to hotkey to every slot in my inventory. You only have nine slots, but I have 12 side buttons. So there are three buttons that weren't there for anything because I didn't want to accidentally click them and do something while fighting that I didn't want to do. Uh, but now I thought hmm, I could do something with that and my 12th key is my perspective uh, perspective toggle key so I finally have a perspective toggle key that I don't have to let go of my mouse off to click oh okay I already hate that why wouldn't you be able to place blocks or ladders there that's stupid okay that's not good about this map. So it looks pretty fancy overall, but gameplay wise, it's really not good. It has an Acropolis situation going on that you can go mid and instantly get stacked. And you can place ladders where you should be able to place ladders. That's pretty annoying. So about mid and gameplay in general, hmm, 
I don't like that. But from the looks of this map, it's amazing. It really is. Yes, it really... Dude, it just looks so good. This tree and everything. And this time, you aren't going to beat me in PvP. Thank you so much. It probably isn't going to end up in my favorites since, uh, yeah, gameplay-wise, as I said, it's really not the greatest. But other than that, if you just go by looks, this is the fanciest map I've played so far. I enjoy this map the most from all the maps I already played. Oh, my bet's gonna be gone. By the way, as soon as you're done watching this video, you can go down in the comments and, uh, yeah, basically comment which of these maps you like and which you don't like, or maybe just comment about a certain map you want to say something about. I always love reading comments, so just go ahead and leave some so I can react to them, give you a heart, respond to you if you have a question, or, I mean, I respond to most of the comments, even if they're not a question. Some people just say, hey, good video, and I'm still responding like, hey, thank you so much. So I'm probably gonna respond to your comment, like, 99%. <laughs> Alright, but now let's just take out this person. It's not gonna be a problem, probably. Hopefully. <laughs> I mean, this person is like, oh my god. This person is like, nope. Five high pixel levels is what I wanted to say, and then they started chucking fireballs at me. At me, not at me. <gasps> Lol, I'm dead. <laughs> and they said easy. Uh, unfortunate. This map is called Pavilion. And um, let's check out this house real quick. Because you actually get spawned in a mansion. And mid is a fancy garden. I don't know if it's a, an Acropolis mid. It might be an Acropolis mid just by the looks of it. But it looks really fancy at least. <laughs> pretty sad that we didn't win last game. I could obviously record that again, but that wouldn't be like my original reaction to the map anymore and that wouldn't make any sense, so... Mm. Uh, I guess I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna diagonal. The problem with most of these maps when you diagonal on them, usually it is like you go to mid or semi-mid and then you go to the next map, like how you rush on Pernicious for example, if you diagonal on Pernicious. Uh, but on most of these new maps, it's just way too far to go all the way to there and then to here. It's just faster going like this, but it feels kind of weird. Also, I think these mansions look different from the inside. I think they're a different color, like the walls, depending on what base you are at. Oh yes, definitely. I really like that touch. It's a really nice detail. Oh my god, this map is so big. Let's just check out mid. So yeah, but this is definitely the proof. They didn't just add new maps that are really small, but instead they also added new maps that are like decently sized. I would even go as far as to call this... Ooh, chandelier. No, I wouldn't call this chandelier. Uh, I would go as far as to call this a big map. Not even mid-sized anymore, it's actually big. Oh my god, what's going on here? This is such a confusing mid. You have like a labyrinth here to get to the diamond gen. I believe it is sort of going for an Acropolis mid, but it doesn't have the same effect since you have to like go through a lot of trouble to get to the gens. Okay. Okay, if you bridge up a decent amount like me, this is more than 64 blocks to rush. This is such a far rush. You are probably better off just going mid and rushing people from there. I don't know why, but it feels like I'm playing on a cracked Bellwars server. This map doesn't look like casual Bellwars, and we have another map yet to play. It's called like Lucky Rush, and it looks like a casino. Uh, actually, it doesn't. It looks like just these uh, machines you have in the casino there. And uh, that is so ugly, first of all. And second of all, that also is going to feel like playing on a cracked server. Yes, okay, they died. Nice. Wait, why is behind me? Just good that I have a new perspective key, so I toggle my perspective more often. Okay, you voided? Sure that was worth it? I don't know. Also, the... I wanted to say that earlier. The color of the bets in Hypixel Bellwars mod are switched up. Which is always not a good thing. Overall, I don't really enjoy this map. I like the details, like that the walls have a different color depending on what base you're in. I like all the details. I also think mid looks fancy. 
but I don't think it feels good as a Bear Wars map. Let's actually try to get some diamonds over at these diamond gems. Oh, I don't like that. I'm gonna hit my head a lot there. Actually, I'm not gonna play this map probably, so it's not gonna matter. But uh, that's annoying. They void it again? Okay, let's see if that first fight on the bridge was actually weird. Or if I just... Okay, this is like confirmed that if you don't have a rank on this server, your hits are worse. Your hits don't register as good. That's... what? <laughs> Why a high pixel? Okay, now this is probably my least favorite map so far. Okay, hey, yeah, this also confirms it. The generator is elevated from the ground as opposed to being same level or how it's supposed to be lower than the rest of the map. Uh, yeah, this looks insanely ugly. All right, <laughs> thanks for building a bridge for me. No! Oh, they died as well. It's cool. <laughs> I was... <laughs> I actually wanted to complain about the hits not registering again, but I couldn't. I had to concentrate so much on that fight, it was crazy. Okay, one thing I like about this map, okay, maybe not like, it's weird that it's back there, but at least the diamond gen isn't in mid. A lot of maps that they added apparently focus on being the new Acropolis with the way diamonds and emerald gens are distributed. But at least this map doesn't have diamond gens at mid. Anyways, this mid is horrible. And also it's so far away that not even the red guy that doesn't have a bat anymore did go mid to get emeralds to save his game. So I think it's safe to say this map is just from the looks of it, in my opinion, the worst map so far. And gameplay-wise, it's probably also the worst map so far. <laughs> so, well, that's unfortunate for you, Lucky Rush. Maybe you remember the series I started a while ago, when Hypixel added these challenges, where I wanted to complete all the challenges. Well, uh, I will continue that series at some point. It's not dead, don't worry. Oh my god, okay. Wonderful, wonderful. What did we learn from that? Apparently it's really hard fighting if you don't have the hit detection other people have. I didn't know it was actually that big of a difference. Before I do Hypixel wrong here, I'm gonna try one game of sumos to check if hit detection is actually different. I feel like it actually is. I feel like I'm also dealing a little less KB than on my main account. Okay, you're not doing anything? Now you are. Huh. Let's say it's weird. Something is weird, but I don't know what. Alright, Scorched Sands. I got kind of lucky with queuing this one. I got it like almost instantly. And uh, from the looks of it, this seems to be a pretty decent map. At least that's my first impression. Mid looks like this weird Acropolis mix again, but that's apparently nothing new anymore. I believe this is a straight rush, but green isn't there anyways. And this time, I won't even... Ah, never mind. I will. Okay, they disconnected. Okay, you don't seem to have a trap. We just messed up a block in. Was pretty bad. Okay, that went pretty good. I haven't found- ah, never mind. Okay, I just found him. I'm also down here. I don't- yeah, I actually enjoy this map. It's also pretty Acropolis-like, but it's enjoyable. Let's see if we can win against Grey at PvP. I believe we can, since we have Prot 2 and Sharp, and they shouldn't have any diamond upgrades. I also got two Bridge Axe. Well, that's not my slot for Bridge Axe, that's a new perspective toggle key. Uh, I also have two Bridge Axe, since 
yeah, I had two emeralds and I didn't really know what exactly to do with them. Boop. Wonderful. And, uh, yeah, let's check out the 3Vs maps. Alright, uh, when playing 3Vs, I realized that I'm not really qualified to talk about 3Vs maps, since basically I don't really know anything about the 3Vs slash 4Vs playstyle anymore. So the last time I played these modes was like at least half a year ago, so I can't really tell you if these maps are good gameplay-wise. So I'm just going to show you the game I actually recorded when I realized I can't really talk about that. Have fun with the last game, and goodbye. Alright, this map is called Artemis, and it's supposed to be an antique map, but it looks really modern in my opinion. Let's see, I don't think I dislike this map too much, I don't know, I'm not a 3Vs or 4Vs player. <laughs> so gameplay wise, mm, I, I really enjoy the looks of this map. Mid looks pretty cool, the diamond gen looks pretty cool, they're not together, which is really cool. <laughs> so this is mid, looks pretty cool, we have the gens up there. Yeah. I'm, I'm a fan of this. Looks pretty fancy. This is pretty good to get the TNT down. Oh my god, that's stupid. Okay, let's put down the TNT here. It might not be close enough. Yes! No, you have shears as well! But it doesn't matter, I got the bat! Oh, oh, oh. oh my god. What? Oh, nice. Okay, I got the bet. Oh, okay. Why are they lagging around like that? I don't know. No, I ran out of blocks. <laughs> Wait, I don't have healing. Ugh, doesn't matter. Oh, nice. 